Hi planner friends, it's Sydney from Sid Plans It Out. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Today we're going to be doing my January goals page. And I'm gonna start by saying that it's going to potentially feel like I went overboard. <laughs> like some of it is so I came up with 10 goals, which could feel like a lot, but a lot of these are things that I'm already like in December working into my life and like working on making a thing, I guess, if that makes sense. So I feel like it's not going to be like overwhelming to have these like 10 goals like oh my gosh like I I don't think it's going to be overwhelming I think it's going to be just what I need and I am yeah I am excited about it so let me go through the things that I have here so I have these um if you watch my Hobonichi cousin set up for 2024 um then you saw that I took all of the calendars off of these monthly kits from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop and I put them in my cousin. And I'm gonna use those pages for like a month in review, I think, like highlights of the month kind of thing. That's what I'm thinking at the moment at least. Um, but I want to use the rest of these stickers to create these goal pages every month um, because I want them to I really think it's just because I want to use all of the stickers, but I also <laughs> like when things coordinate. So I feel like I'm using that as a month in review page. And so I should like, you know, so I might as well use these stickers for the um, goals page. Words are really hard. It's still early. Okay, it's almost 10 o'clock, but it feels early. <laughs> okay, and then I have these um calendars from proud sticker designs i have five of them because they're dated for 2024 and i realized after i bought them that i bought the sunday starts and i should have gotten the monday start ones because um my cousin goes by monday start and my brain kind of does monday start so i'm not really sure why I did Sunday start, but that's what I chose. So it's fine. We'll make it work. Um, but yeah, so we're going to use those. Honestly, the other thing is I might not even use these like Sunday through Saturday stickers because I really just need the dates. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'm not a hundred percent sure on that yet. Um, yeah, so I have those and then I have three Tombos. I, <laughs> my sister got me, I'm trying to think, will that, oh yeah, I have a vlog that's going up tomorrow that will, um, that like talks about going to get these, but my sister got me a MasterCard gift card for Christmas and so I used them to buy a bunch of Tombos. So I have, tom or so I used it to buy a bunch of Tombos. So I have a bunch of Tombos now, but I'm going to use 991, 992, and 312. This is what they look like. They're not like perfect matches. I mean, the green is pretty close. Um, they're not perfect matches to these stickers, but I think that they are good enough to work. And I have a concept already in mind for how I want this spread to be like laid out um, because I made like a goal brainstorming page and I really was just playing around like using Tombos, having a good time, whatever. And then I was done with it and I was like, oh, this is actually really cute. So, <laughs> so yeah, that's, that's what we're, what we're doing. So the first thing I want to do I think I'm going to label this and I have to decide. So I want one of these to be for the title and then two of them to be in the body of it. I think I'm going to use this for the title because it like matches the least. So I it, like it'll stand out the most. So I think that's that's what we're going to do here. So 
Oh, and this is just a piece of, I think it's 30 pound um, printer paper. I'm not really sure what what it is, but it's very nice. It's smooth and it's it's nice paper. So let's dive in here. So I'm just gonna letter January. Nope, that's not very centered, but that's okay. So we'll do January. Um, I'm gonna do goals. And I'm just going to write it. And then even though there's really no reason to put 2024 in there, I'm going to. And I'm gonna use the the small side, like the not brush pen side. And I'm gonna put 2024 in there. So January 2024 goals. Cute. I really like the way that looks. All right, the next thing I want to do is I want to figure out how I can use these because these fit, I think they fit classic sized paper, but this is big paper. So I have to figure out like what I'm going to do with them. Part of me is thinking it would be fun to like put it down this side. I think I'm gonna do that. That's, that's what we're, we're gonna give that a try. And I want to take the white pieces off the edges here. So hopefully I did. <laughs> we'll see how well that worked out for me. And these are not gonna line. <gasps> no! Oh my gosh. That was um, embarrassing. Um, these are not gonna line up perfectly. But, I mean, I could kind of make them line up. No, no, no. I should have cut that off before I put it down. That's what I should have done. I'm gonna cut this off before I put it down. Because I could kind of make them line up. Well, I thought I would be able to, hold on. No, they don't line up like that. Okay, that's fine. I'm okay with it. It's 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 gonna be okay. I don't think that I put this first one down straight. <laughs> so that's awkward, but it's fine. Okay, let's cut this piece off. The struggle of scrap paper gosh okay scrap paper scrap stickers whatever I'm struggling I swear I I promise I had coffee I mean I like kind of just finished it but I did have coffee so I would think that I would be a little you know a little more together but obviously that would be asking too much of myself look at how crooked I put that down good lord this is not going to look as good as I want it to, I can already tell. It's fine, it's fine. I'm just not gonna look at it while I'm cutting it. And then I'll look at it and be like, well, that's how it is. And we're just gonna go with it. What is happening? Oh, it's like, why can't I cut this? Because it's all curled up on itself. All right, how poorly did I do with that? Wow, so bad. How did I, whatever, <laughs> it is what it is. Oops. I really am not sure how I put that down so incredibly crooked. That's um, awkward. Okay, I feel like I want to use this piece, but I don't know where 
or how I would use it. I could just like stick it up here, actually. I might just do that just to use this piece because I don't want it to go to waste. I think that was also incredibly crooked, but you know, whatever. Hold on. Oh, nope, okay. I was gonna try to pull that up and rearrange it, but this paper wants none of that, so that's fine. All right, well, besides that awkwardness over there, um, I like the way that this looks. <laughs> I don't know how I managed that, to put that down so incredibly crooked, but it's fine. I kind of think that I don't like that there, but I'm not gonna mess with trying to pull it up. So let's do the things here. I think I want to punch this first because I want to make sure that I know where the punches are going to be. Excuse me, paper, if you could just line up where I want you to. That'd be great. All right. Oh, geez. Oh, no. Okay. That's fine. Sorry. I'm being loud. This is a great start to this video. <laughs> okay. So I have, like I said, I have 10 goals, but I only have five boxes. So I have some goals that I want to use these calendars with. So the ones that get calendars are not gonna get a box. And then the ones obviously that don't get calendars will have a box. So that is my plan here. So let's start with this Tombow. So the way that I did this, I actually, like I said, I really liked the way that I did this. Um, in my just playing around. Uh, <laughs> so I'm going to continue with that, or I'm going to do it that way. So what I did was I drew these like blobs and then I outlined them like this. And then I took, oh gosh, my Tombow Fudunisuke and uh, I numbered them and I just really liked the way that it looked. So that's what we're going to do. So my first goal, these are in no particular order. It's just the way that I thought of them, um, is the order that they're in. So the first goal is one that's going to get a calendar. So do I want to put the calendar down first? Do I want to put the calendar off to the side? How do I want to do this? I did not think this through. I could put it up here. How does that look though with that? I feel like I want to leave that space to put like some of those extra decorations in. So it might just like go off to the side or maybe I do this. I'll just put it here and then we'll write the goal in. So that is really crooked, isn't it? How? Well, I know how because there's no lines or anything on this page. Nope, it's not gonna come up. So it's just gonna be crooked. All right, so this first goal is going to be um, Jim, two to three times a week. So that's my goal there. That's goal number one. Goal number two, which now that I'm thinking about this, this one's going to have a box and I don't want it to like line up perfectly with this. So maybe it goes here. See the way that I did this when I was just like brainstorming is just like a, a, like a list. So now I'm like, hmm, 
hmm, how do I make it um, work with what I'm actually using? <laughs> the struggle. Because I'm, what if I put it here? Well, not that color box because we're using this, but. Ooh, except I don't. Because I want to swap like one, two, I want to swap these. I don't actually want it over there all the way because then it would be like green straight down and brown straight down and I don't like that. So, hmm. Maybe we don't use the boxes. Maybe we save the boxes and use them for um, like the month in review thing. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. I'm probably completely overthinking this. I get that, but <laughs> I want it to be pretty. I feel like we all know, like when, if it's pretty, then it's more likely to like get used, right? That's how I feel about it at least. Let's see. So I don't really wanna put it right there because then like I said, it would be like green all the way here and brown all the way here. Hmm. But I also like don't want this to line up with that. You know what I mean? I might just have to get over it. We're just gonna put this here. And uh, we'll use this one. Whoops. I should have let that dry just a touch. I'm gonna wait to write in there. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, this one I want to um, meal plan and this has like a double purpose. So purpose number one to this is it's going to help with making sure that I'm not eating out as much. Purpose number two is it's going to help, well, actually it kind of has like three. Um, I won't eat out as much, hopefully, if I have things planned to eat during the week. I won't spend as much on groceries because I won't be buying just like random things and hoping for the best. Um, and then, actually maybe that was just the two. I feel like I thought of something else, but then I started talking and I don't remember. But this is like saving money in like multiple ways, like with groceries, with eating out, with, you know, whatever. And also it's going to, I think, be really nice for um, eating better. Cause I just feel like I'm just not, I mean, I know that I'm just not eating great right now. So <laughs> yeah, not, not doing well in that front. All right. The next one that I have, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna, maybe I just won't do them in the order that they are up there. Maybe that'll help. Cause the next one I had was another calendar one, but I don't wanna put a calendar right under that calendar. So I think we're gonna do, actually not this color box. Because I know I said I was going to like, I don't want, like I said, I don't want all green and all brown. So we're just going to put this here. I mean, I could bring the yellow in, I guess, and that would actually get rid of my problem, wouldn't it? Yeah, let's just do that. Okay, and then we're gonna wait to draw on that since I learned my lesson there. And this one is going to be um, limiting limit um, social media slash phone time. And then like part of that, I'm thinking app limits, which I had on my phone at one point, um, on my phone. 
yeah, I had them on my phone at one point. Sorry, I got distracted. And then I got rid of them. And I think that I need to put them back because, yeah. I think I want to do though, instead of, so before I had it like a, with a time limit, I kind of think that I want to do like, instead of a time limit, I want to do like, you can only use it during these hours kind of thing. Um, but I'm not, not a hundred percent sure on that yet. So we'll come back to it, but it's kind of what I'm thinking there. All right. The next one that I want to do, so I don't forget it since I skipped it. Um, <laughs> let's go actually, no, let's do, hmm, now I have to figure out, I still think I'm going to end up with like greens in a row, but it's going to be okay. Let's do here. Oh, wait, hold on. I want to make sure that I'm leaving. Like, I want to make sure there's going to be enough room. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think there will be. I'm just like, I don't want to run out of space. <laughs> so we'll put one here. This one is going to be... Ugh. That was a lot. I want to, I'm not quite sure how to write this one because I wrote like a novel when I wrote this out, but more or less I want to work on um, oh geez, work on setting a daily routine so like what time am I going to get up every day what time am I going to um or what am I going to do during my lunch break every day what time am I going to um at the end of the day like what time am I going to be like okay I'm done doing anything productive now like you know productive now like now I'm going to just sit and watch tv or um read a book or something like that. Like I want to set more or less like an ideal day kind of routine or kind of thing and then make a routine out of that and I just I just want to have more of a daily routine because right now I don't have one. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants and hoping for the best. And you know <laughs> it's uh not going great always. I think I'm going to put this one on this side. And yes, I know I skipped the brown, but I did it on purpose. Um, this one, okay, I don't, I don't spend a ton of money on Amazon, but I feel like if I did a no spend on Amazon, it would definitely be for the best <laughs> for a month. So that's what this one's going to be. This is going to be no spend on Amazon because I just, I don't know. And I know a lot of the stuff that I was spending on Amazon in December was like Christmas presents, but at the same time, I feel like I got a little carried away and I need to you know, work on, and I need to just like set a no spend for myself for January. All right, next let's do, I think we'll do this green box. We'll go here and use the brown. There's gonna be like all calendars at the bottom. I just realized that, but that's okay. All right, this one is going to be, um, okay. This is one that I, when I was looking at my word of the year page and trying to figure out like, what do I wanna do based off of like that page more or less? I want to spend more time out of my apartment during the week. Like I'm just, I'm not leaving my apartment. And I have like a travel monitor, like an extra monitor for my computer. Cause I feel like sometimes 
one of the reasons that it's nice to like stay at home and work is because I have two screens, but I have a travel one that I can use to like leave my apartment as well. Or I could like, you know, go to the office since we do have an office space. But this one is going to be, also I get so distracted during the day that I just feel like I need to, and it doesn't even have to be like a full day, but I feel like once a week, I would really like to work from somewhere that's not my house. <laughs> and like I said, it doesn't have to be a full day. It could just be like, I go there in the morning or I go and work somewhere in the afternoon and then, you know, like go and do the rest of my day after that. Like that is kind of what I'm thinking. So we're gonna do work. Um, outside, I think that's how I'm gonna put it. Outside of my apartment, like, heck, I, my mom works from home too, so I could literally go sit in my parents' house, whatever. <laughs> I could do like there there's a lot of options that I have. And there are 5 weeks in January. So, I'm going to do I think I'm just going to use this. And I'm just going to draw five circles here. Oops. And this first week I'm only working um, <laughs> like three days, but that's okay. I'm kind of thinking that I do need those days of the week now. Like I'm looking at this and I'm like, yeah, I might need those. I didn't really want to use them, but I think I might need them just like for my brain. And uh, I, w I was thinking when I got these and realized they were Sunday start, I was like, oh man, well that's okay, I can just make them Monday, but no I can't because they're like dated for, yeah, they're like dated and everything, so it's not gonna work. All right, what am I at? One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, let's um, do these really quick since they're probably dry now. This will also help me keep track of where the heck I'm at. Okay, great. Six. All right. Uh, la, la 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 la. All right. The next one, I think I'm gonna do another calendar over here. So we'll do. I think I'm gonna do it like this and then I'm gonna use yellow again the next one I'm gonna do over here is gonna be green and actually let's just do another calendar over there and make it green while I'm thinking about it And let's also do the days of the week. I'm really, really enjoying how this page is turning out. I do have to say though, <laughs> I feel like I, oh, I fudged up. It's fine, we'll put it at the bottom. I did not think that through all the way. That's okay. That's fine. Um, I do have to say I kind of like the other one better, but I also, the other one is like in my favorite colors. Like my brainstorming page is in my favorite colors. So it kind of makes sense, but it's fine. Um, <laughs> this one is going to be, um, let's write it here. We're going to do read. And there's some of these, like a lot of them. Well, not a lot of them, but like this one and this one, are 
things that I'm tracking and what this one's going to be are things that are in my Hobonichi weeks, but I feel like seeing them all in one like calendar page like this is actually it like is going to be really helpful to me to like really see where I'm at because like seeing it week to week is useful, but I feel like seeing it like in a full calendar form is way more useful like for my brain. So which I feel like that's relatable. I mean, maybe not, but I feel like when you see it all together, it just makes more sense. All right, this one, because sleep has been an adventure recently, and I would love to get eight hours of sleep because I definitely work better like my brain just works better if I have eight hours of sleep but like consistently have eight hours of sleep like the other night I slept for like almost 10 hours because I had been sleeping for only like six so definitely need to work on some consistent sleep and yeah like I just it's gonna make me feel better <laughs> I should have made this one six it's fine All right, two more. Last two are one more box and one more calendar. So I think we'll put the box here and then we'll put the last calendar here and days of the week. All right, what colors do we have? One, two, three of those. So we need another brown one. We have three yellows. For sure need another brown one, which is going to be this one since that box is brown. Actually, I might do it on this side too. So that's not the only one. <laughs> we have brown and then I guess green. All right, this one is going to be, I want to, so I have like Procreate on my iPad and I really like drawing, um, whether it's on Procreate or just like on paper. Um, so I want to work on, like I want to make a habit out of drawing um, one to two times a week. Um, or that's how I want to start is by doing it one to two times a week. I just wanna make it more of a habit. I feel like it's kind of a, like I forget about it and then I'll be super bored and I'm like, oh yeah, I can do that, I forgot. Like, I don't know what it is, but I want to do some sort of drawing one to two times a week, whether that's like I said, on Procreate on my iPad or just on some paper. I think I want to buy, I've been, I really, really like drawing on, the Hobonichi paper, it, it feels really nice. So I think I'm gonna buy like a Hobonichi notebook um, so I can have that paper to draw on because I very much enjoy it. And then this last one is one that I've been like, I feel like I've been trying to incorporate this into my life for like the last two years. And sometimes I do really well with it and other times I do not so well with it. So we're just gonna keep adding it. So I want to um, spend time at home, like at my parents' house, which that's just home. It is. It always will be, in my brain at least. Oops. No. Whatever. At home slash with family. Oh, uh, there we go. Um, once a week. I feel like I go through phases where I do like really well with this. And then there's other times where I'm just like atrocious at this. So yeah. And I feel like a lot of it had to do with um, like when I went like out of the country for work. 
it like threw off my life when I came back, but I want to do a better job of that for sure and get like back into that habit and whatnot. So, all right, there we have it. Let's just decorate with some of these now because why not? Like, let's put that here. We have this leaf. Put that there. Let's see, we have another leaf. We can put down here and then put these flowers with it. That's cute. I really, really adore how this page turned out. And I really, really like these circles with uh, the numbers. I kind of got that idea from um, Helen from the Coffee Monsters Co. I was watching one of her older like weekly vlog, weekly journaling vlog kind of things. And she did these like numbers, not quite like these, but she like did blobs like this. And then she did bubble numbers in them. And I was like, oh, I actually kind of like, like the blob idea, like, you know, like the circle blob. So yeah, <laughs> that is where I got the idea from. I feel like this should go here, but then these are both right next to each other. So what do I do with this? Cause it's like too crowded if I put it in there. I'm thinking we'll put like some of it here and then some of it at the top maybe. I don't know. I don't know what to do with it. Maybe I move this. Ugh. Okay, put those there and put this here. And then we have one little leaf. We'll put it there. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I love how this turned out. I love this so much. I'm actually really excited to continue this for like 2024. Cause this is how I want to do like all of these pages. Like I want to use these stickers from Jojo. And I think this turned out so absolutely adorable. Yeah, I'm trying to think though for, do I wanna do it on the back for February or do I want to, I don't know. We'll get there when we get there, right? Yeah, okay. I need to take a step back. I don't know why I'm already like, how do I wanna do it for February? Oh no, I just realized you can't see the whole thing all at once, hold on. Oh no. Okay, <laughs> there we go, that's better. You still can't quite see it all, but you can see most of it. All right, so there is my January goals page. I am very excited. I'm feeling, like I said, I'm feeling pretty good about all of these. There's some of them, like I think the ones that are gonna be the hardest for me are going to be meal planning because I don't know if it's the ADHD or what, but like telling myself I'm going to eat this thing like way before I'm going to eat doesn't always work for my brain because I'm like, well, that doesn't sound good now. So yeah. And food like has to sound good or else I want nothing to do with it. Um, so yeah, that's cool. I, I can't do this. You guys I have to cut this. I know it's going to make the page like oddly shaped, but I have to cut this off. I would rather this, the page be a little oddly shaped. There we go. That's much better. Um, yeah. So meal planning, that one's going to be hard. And then I feel like this one, like the drawing one is going to be hard just because like I said, I kind of like forget about it. So that one could be a little bit difficult for me. And I feel like this one's going to be hard too. Um, but we'll see like not super hard, but like harder. So we'll see how it goes, but I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about these goals and I am ready to really like dive into them. 
for January. So that's going to be all for me in this video. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, you can hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.